Hello everybody, welcome back to my new video and today I have Street Life Vlog and let's start with a bit of an update because my room changed a lot as you can see all the street lights are back here this board, <laughs> it's pretty cool all the street lights that are still in my room are back here I'm gonna place this thing here, it looks pretty cool, <laughs> I like it. These old books are still here and there are some traffic lights. And <laughs> this fixture which is just too beautiful to... You know, this thing is just too beautiful to put somewhere back there, so that's why it's here. There's still this box of low pressure sodium, but I don't know what to do with it. And this is still the same. And I also made this, but that was on my own channel, but I still want to show it because it's pretty cool. As you can see, flashing traffic light. It actually is a Dutch railroad uh, crossing. <laughs> we can let both lights flash. Normally when there ain't a train, this one is flashing and when there comes a train, the white one goes out and the red one starts flashing. And the video you are going to see is from an abandoned building I went to with a friend in Germany. There were some rare street lights, there are also some SCS203 fixtures which was really weird to find in an abandoned building in Germany. <laughs> and there is a video segment in between those videos I sh shoot there, shot there, which was about a streetlight fixture that broke off and still works, worked. So yeah, I also wanted to film, I wanted to film that. cycling again for some broken street lights and this is the first one which is pink as you can see <laughs> that's a common problem with PLL bulbs but yeah I'm going to do it a bit uh, different this time because I'm not going to film the whole evening but just when I find a broken street light I'm going to film it so yeah enjoy <laughs> enjoy some some pictures of broken street lights
Um, so the amount of broken streetlights I found yesterday was 10, which is a lot. And I got <laughs> an email back from the council. And I think they know that their street lighting isn't that good anymore. So I got an email back from them and they are uh, and they are going to do the exact same as I do most of the time. I'm just trying to find broken street lights. So they are going to do that because they know that there are many problems with street lights. Here there are some there are complete, nah, I wouldn't say complete streets, but there are streets where there are four poles that don't work, but that's because of the cables, because there are many, many old cables here. And many broken lamps as well, and I don't think there are that many people that are aware of the app we are using to send broken streetlights to the council, because there's an app that everyone can download. You don't, it's for uh, broken street lights, but it's also for, uh, I don't know, dangerous pavements or uh, signs or traffic lights or trees. But yeah, it's uh, good that they know that, there is, <laughs> that, this, that the system sucks. So, uh, it's, but yeah, that is what the email was about. And so I don't have to do that anymore. And I'm going to cycle again uh, this evening because it's still the weather is still very nice. And I also bought some things. I I talked about it, but I don't know if I'm going to put that part of the, the video I took I think a week ago in the street life vlog because it's pretty boring. <laughs> I was just telling something which I'm doing now again. Mm, I bought this poster here, or I sort of made it. And another <laughs> amiibo, <laughs> but that doesn't really matter for this channel. So yeah, enjoy the video of me cycling. <laughs>